Good morning, everybody. My name is Darren Davis. Uh, I appreciate you coming out this morning. Um, this is my first trip to Bangalore, uh, but I think my fifth trip to India. I am by no means an expert in India, uh, but I seem to have more experience of it than most of my friends back in the United States. And so when they ask me about it, I tell them, well, the, the thing you have to understand about India, if you really want to understand India, you have to understand that roughly 80% of the population is Hindu, roughly 14% Muslim, 3 to 4% Christian, and 100% cricket. So <laughs> the fact that you are all here this morning, today, during the semifinals between Australia and India is a great testament to your dedication to Agile, and I appreciate it. Uh, I am the Director of Software Engineering for Providence Health and Services. I'm part of their strategy and innovation group. Prior to that, uh, I worked as the, uh, uh, I managed the development and mobile development and web development teams for a small coffee company called Starbucks, which I think you, you have a few Starbucks here in, uh, in India now. Uh, prior to that, back in 2006, uh, I was a development manager for a company called Corbis. Corbis is a media and image licensing company owned by Bill Gates with a really remarkable ability to lose money. So I, I worked for Corbis for probably eight years, and in that time, it was never profitable, and yet every year I got a five-figure bonus. So when Bill Gates went from being the richest man in the world to being the second richest man in the world, I like to say that I played a part in that just by working for Corbis. <clears throat> Incidentally, I, I guess he's now back on top as number one because I no longer work for Corbis. So I, I'll leave that to you to figure out. So 2006, summer of 2006, our sustainment engineering process was in a shambles. And I, when I say sustainment engineering, I'm talking about what's essentially that developer gulag you go to where you have to do all the support and maintenance work on existing systems. You don't get to do any of the new fun stuff. You do small feature enhancements, you do bug fixes. That's, that was our sustainment process, and it was a mess. We were running it as a series of waterfall-like projects, fixed scope, uh, releasing every quarter. Um, I, I used to liken it to like scooping a load of socks out of the dryer and trying to crab walk it up a flight of stairs without dropping anything. Uh, needless to say, it was disappointing for all the reasons that you would expect a, a waterfall-like process to be disappointing. Things would get dropped from scope. We'd run late. We wouldn't be able to do as much as they wanted. Often when we did those things, they weren't exactly what they wanted three months ago, right? So all kinds.